How to play Metal Gear Solid V Split Screen Multiplayer on PC. <laughs> You're pretty good. First download and install the Nucleus Co-op app. Ignore all the stupid virus warnings. Install to see Nucleus Scoop. Go to Windows Defender and add the C Nucleus Scoop folder to the exclusion list. Now run Nucleus as an administrator. Click Download Game Handler and search for Metal Gear Solid V. Click the Download button. Click Yes to locate the game executable. Navigate to your Game Install folder and select mgsvmgo.exe. The handler is now in your library. Let's click on it and look at the handler author's notes. Open the three links listed here to install the required software as. These will allow us to run an offline Metal Gear Online 3 server. First, install Docker Desktop for Windows. If it asks you to choose between WSL and Hyper-V, choose WSL. Keep Docker Desktop open. Next, install the .NET X6 for runtime for Windows. Finally, download the MGO3 server emulator. Extract the zip file and double-click run server.bat. Please wait patiently while it loads the server into Docker. It will only need to do this once. You can close the window once it's done. Always run run server.bat before playing. Go back to Nucleus. We're now ready to enjoy some tactical espionage. Available input devices will appear at the top. Press any button or key on your input device to highlight it. You can assign either a controller or a mouse and keyboard to an instance. Click this to select a layout. I'll choose the two-player horizontal layout. Drag and drop your input devices to the layout. You may also plug in an extra monitor and assign players to it. Click the green arrow here. You can choose an internal resolution for each instance to run at. However, don't choose anything below 108 OP when using the two-player horizontal layout. Or there will be cropping issues. You can also set the graphics setting to a preset. Click the play button to start the session. Wait for each instance to start and reposition. Your inputs will now be locked. Press the N key to unlock them when you want to end the session. Accept all the startup messages. While in the hub map, press Start or Tab to open the MGO3 menu. You can fully customize your character, gear, and loadout. Each player's settings and customizations will be saved separately. To start a match, go back to the online menu, select Matching, and select Create Match. Edit the match parameters if you like. I recommend enabling rush mode to reduce the map size. Other players can join the match by going to the online menu, matching, and then select match. Select the other player's lobby. Wait for the briefing period to end, and then ready up. Have fun, comrades! If you need help, join the Nucleus Discord, go to the hashtag support channel, and tag at Happy Express.